It is an architectural and acoustic treasure. St. Mary's Church in PEI's Indian River was built in 1902, and more than 100 years later, it continues to be one of the country's most celebrated cultural milieus. The church has meant everything to this community for many years and past the religious portion of it when Indian River Festival first initiated probably 15 years ago now. It just brought tradition and heritage into the music world as well. Music lovers flock to St. Mary's every year to hear internationally renowned musicians who perform at the Indian River Music Festival. This year was the best year we ever had in terms of audience attendance. Over 6,000 people came, which was, I think, 25% over last year, another 25% over the year before. So people come from all over and they know about the festival and they know the acoustics in this beautiful place and that the caliber of artists that we have here is just world class. Um, the acoustics are just unparalleled here. It's so beautiful. The people are so warm here, so the artists just tell us over and over again that they love the hospitality, the lobsters, the beaches, and, and above all, this place, because it's just unmatched in performance space for them. It's lovely and, and warm and envelops you. It, uh, if you. If you're singing in the shower, you know you sing in the shower because you sound good. To come in here and play, it's the same kind of thing. It feels warm, it feels like you don't have to push, you just get to relax and play. It's lovely. The church has undergone a $357,000 restoration with new stained glass, detailed woodworking, and even a new roof. The windows that we worked on, which were just the ones, the, the great big one down here that the Horace was describing is perhaps the biggest in, <laughs> on the island for a wood frame window. Um, because the actual frame of the window was uh, rotting, uh, the wood, so the windows were, were being sort of bent and twisted by their winds and exposure that it was getting there. There's other work to be done here too. Some of the windows um, up in the Clara story up here are actually date back to uh, about the time that the church was built so um, because they're close to a hundred years of age and they're diamond panes then the lead on them is actually starting to break down. The province contributed one-third of the cost with money from Build PEI. The Premier says it's a sound investment in island culture. The province is uh, extremely happy uh, to be investing in this project with the federal government and with the Indian River Festival. Uh, this beautiful facility uh, is a great spot uh, for music, for entertainment. Of course, it's an old, beautiful church. Uh, and it's very important for us to protect our heritage here and uh, for the cultural component of it, uh, it makes it that much better, especially in the summertime. If you have the opportunity to come through here and uh, catch a concert, uh, it's absolutely spectacular.